Hey everybody, Purple for the day, just coming at you from my secret location. How are you doing tonight? Um, there's a lot of stuff going on uh, here and in the world and uh, different countries warning of power cuts and power outages. And whether or not your country is warning of power cuts and power, let me see, <laughs> whether or not your country is uh, warning of power cuts and power, power outages or not, there's something you really need to know. And it's something that people from Texas experienced and learned the hard way. And one of them is that if your, excuse me, if your power goes out for long enough in a cold or uh, below freezing situation, your pipes will start to freeze. And when your pipe, your water pipes freeze, the water expands into ice and they break the pipes. And then when the when the pipes burst open, that's when you get a flush of water through that break in the pipe and it starts flooding your house. And there's nothing you can do to stop that from flooding your house except to shut it off via the shutoff valve. And the shutoff valve, you need to know where that is. Okay, so if you're just joining us uh, on, this, on this journey, um, there will be a shutoff valve where the near where the water is coming into your house so whether if you have a basement if you have a cellar if you have a crawl space if you have a cabinet you need to locate that now and not when there's an emergency um i guess in some places in texas what they did was they did the shutoff valve and they walled that off so that the people couldn't get to it which is bad <laughs> yes another osha violation <laughs> but yeah the uh, water valve, the shutoff valve, is something you need to know about now before the power goes out and your pipes freeze and burst. Or if you have to leave your house, this is another scenario, if you have to leave your house because your house gets too cold, you will want to go to that power shutoff, go to that water shutoff and, and crank it shut, shut off that water to the house because the worst situation is you uh, it gets too cold you pack up the kids you pack up you know your spouse whatever and leave and then come back to a flooded house because the water has broke the, uh, the the water shutoff valve was in the open in the open position and your pipes freeze they broke and then it sprayed water and nobody was there to hit the water shutoff valve that is another scary situation so that's one of the things you have to use to have your smarts to learn beforehand where the shutoff valve is. Also, make sure you can get to it. Oh yeah, it's on the other side of that grand mound pile of boxes. No, you don't want that. So uh, you might want to clear a path now just in case something goes wrong later. And I've just seen a few uh, YouTube videos of people who have already experienced power shutoffs, uh, blackouts in their country. And it's the planned blackouts in the country. So we shall see what happens. Uh, but I got to go because I think my puppy wants out. So all right. Okay. All right. Take care and uh, stay warm. Thanks. Bye.